you can see here when the channel started their second video got 5.3 million views and that's really down to youtube pushing these shorts really really hard but how are they hey guys what's going on james here back with the income journey and in today's video we're going to be taking a look at an affiliate marketing strategy that some people are using to drive insane amounts of free traffic to affiliate offers and make a lot of money from it. In this video, we're gonna take a look at a couple of channels that are using this model to make some insane amounts of money. We're gonna show you like how they're doing it, the strategy behind it, and actually some tips that if I was running this model, I would also maybe implement to increase the amount of revenue. But this is kind of a crazy strategy that is blowing up right now. There's lots of people utilizing it. And these guys have kind of taken their own twist on it, utilized it for affiliate marketing to drive free traffic, and it's working well for them. So let's go ahead and jump into the computer. This is probably gonna be a short video, but this channel just popped up on my recommended one day. And I like started looking at what they were doing. And I was like, I have to make a video on this. This is kind of insane. It's a very cool model. So let's go ahead jump in and take a look at it so right here you can see the channel in question and that is fitness shorts you can see they're actually verified over here on youtube the channel didn't start that long ago if we jump in here to videos and we go to oldest you'll see the channel started about six months ago and youtube shorts only came out about six months ago or kind of maybe in the last year or so really got popular about six months ago and since then youtube have really been pushing shorts you've probably seen on your youtube channel lots of shorts popping up pretty much every big youtuber under the sun has created a clips channel where they go ahead and upload clips under 60 seconds maybe from their twitch streams it's especially big in the gaming community you'll see pretty much every one of the sidemen have a clips channel now which is essentially just uploading shorts because these things are getting pushed out it gains them a lot of exposure the revenue you earn on a short is obviously not going to be all that much but how can you go out there and capitalize on this you obviously probably don't have 7 million subscribers on your main channel and can just go and create a clips channel but what you can do is create a channel that is essentially a no content youtube channel you've maybe seen in the past some of these other like no content youtube channels or the video videos on YouTube which say you can make money on YouTube without showing your face and there is lots of channels out there like that where they maybe hire people to write scripts and then someone to record the voices and then they make money off the ad revenue and maybe some other offers however with this model it's a little bit different because people are going out there and using other people's content it's up to you whether you do this obviously some of the biggest you know kind of pages on instagram they've been doing this for years just stealing people's content giving credit in the description and going and growing these pages i used to in the past grow pages on instagram in like the travel niche where you'd use other people's photos give them credit and everyone kind of won and this is kind of what they're doing here in this kind of business model so what they're doing is uploading these shorts they're all under 60 seconds these guys are clearly doing it in a provocative way right we've got here fitness shorts it's clearly that these are all very good looking women uh doing you know kind of fitness stuff and these are obviously girls from instagram and they're pulling the clips if we take a look uh, at one of the videos right here some girl doing a handstand and it says you know no uh copyright infringement if you want to get the stuff removed you can get it removed and then obviously if they have the credits they go ahead and credit here in a lot of these descriptions as well i'm not sure if they did it back at the start but now that are doing that you can see here when the channel started their second video got 5.3 million views and that's really down to youtube pushing these shorts really really hard if we take a look at their most popular videos this one has 46 million views that is absolutely outrageous for a youtube channel that is only six months old and you can see here 35 million 29 million they're hitting these multi-million views you know repeatedly here every couple of months like they have you know so many videos a ridiculous amount of videos over 1 million views they actually have a ridiculous amount of videos here that are over 1 million views so how are these guys generating revenue well what they're doing is uploading these videos and they're getting a lot of impressions on the videos and what they then do to generate revenue is this community tab over here so once you get a certain amount of subscribers on youtube i'm not exactly sure of how many that is it's probably in around a thousand you unlock the community tab you've maybe seen them on my channel where sometimes i do polls and stuff like that well they were also like an abused feature on youtube whenever youtube or instagram or any of these platforms release a new feature it's generally good to use them to get more exposure because they push that new feature so the community tab and shorts are kind of being pushed at the same time 
So what happens is they go ahead, you can see here six minutes ago, these guys posted a community tab and this is an Amazon affiliate link. This is how they make their money. And you can see these get crazy engagements. Obviously this one here, not massive engagement, but if we take a look at this one, one day ago, best dumbbell, set, dumbbell sets for home, you can see here this got 12,000 likes, 101 comments. And again, using a provocative photo as the marketing. But here's the thing. I'd say that not very many people are actually clicking on this link and going ahead and buying dumbbells, but all that matters is they get a click from this post. And they're gonna look at this, the personal maybe say, oh, what are these dumbbells? So if we click on this, best dumbbell sets for home, this is just a simple search on Amazon. Just doing a simple search here and creating an Amazon affiliate link. And you can see all of the different dumbbells that show up on Amazon when you search that. But the beauty of Amazon affiliate is, not only that I've clicked their link, if I go at you know sometime in the next 24 hours and purchase a book or purchase a new microwave or whatever it is, they're gonna get a commission for that. And then a certain portion of those people who click are gonna end up buying something. Yes, a few people here and there might buy dumbbells, but I'd say where these guys are making most of their money is going out there and just people buying random stuff on Amazon. I've had people come in through my Amazon affiliate links, and you can see here over the past couple of months, we've made nearly a thousand dollars on Amazon Associates through my blogs. These guys are going out there and probably selling way more than that due to the amount of impressions that they're getting, like 12,000 on this one. On this one, they clearly got paid to promote some crappy cryptocurrency. Uh, I probably wouldn't do that, but they've went ahead and done that. It's another revenue source. They're getting paid for posts now. Uh, right down here, they've launched a Teespring store, so they're doing some e-commerce stuff. I'm not sure who's gonna buy like Teespring stuff off these guys, but I'd say the Amazon affiliate thing is the best way to monetize this type of traffic and engagement. Uh, right here, this is clearly an Onnit affiliate link. So Onnit is a huge brand. Joe Rogan has a stack in it. These guys are massive in kind of the fitness and supplement, uh, you know, kind of business. And here they're directing people to a workout plan that you can uh, go ahead and purchase. So 10 workouts under 10 bucks and it gets in 30 minutes or less. So they're promoting this. If they make a sale on that, they probably actually make a pretty good commission. It's probably like 25% or something on these digital products right here. And then again, just sometimes promoting the videos, sometimes promoting Amazon affiliate links, uh, best fitness deals of the day. This literally just links to Amazon. These are not fitness deals really. What is this? Like a little scooter thing. Uh, there is some fitness stuff here, obviously, but it's just random pages, really. International sales offers. So they're just sending you to the sales offers on Amazon for the day. People are gonna click that link and they're going to go ahead and purchase something in the 24 hours. You get a 24 hour cookie on Amazon. So if they purchase anything, they're gonna make a small commission from this. And with the amount of traffic they're getting, like they post pretty much daily, if not multiple times a day uh, on this, but you can see here, we would like to take a moment to raise awareness for our crypto friends. They're posting that again, and it got 548 likes. This one got 20,000. A lot of these are obviously just getting likes because of the type of photos that they are. But again, as long as someone clicks that link, they don't care. And these short channels, this is not the only people doing this. These guys have multiple of these short channels. So right here, we've Epic Fitness Shorts. This one not doing as well but if we jump in here let's take a look they're maybe building this one up to sell and they're posting like you know eight times a day it's like meet kevin over here uh so let's go to most popular we can see that they started this one about a month ago and it's done 31,000 views they're getting quite a few that are getting traction if you just post 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 eventually one of these is going to pop off uh if we look at their other channel i think it's more long form content so if we go back here to daily dose of fitness you can see here, they're now doing like videos. They're kind of doing that model of no content YouTube where they're creating stuff like top 10 Latina fitness models, top eight European fitness models. And these things are actually getting some decent views. We don't have subscribers on this yet, but these are more long form content that they will be able to then monetize through AdSense. So I just thought this was a super interesting model. We can also see here like this channel, Stevie, 1.74 million subscribers. This one is absolutely blown up in the Minecraft niche. All they do is like little small like Minecraft how to's or will it work or just interesting things about Minecraft. But you can see these are all mostly under one minute. And if we sort by most popular, there's so many videos with 11 million views, 7 million views, 6 million. Crazy, crazy amounts of views. And if we go to oldest, again, three months ago. Three months ago, this channel really started to take off, obviously. Yes, it could have went ahead and deleted old videos and stuff like that. I think this channel actually originated like way, way before, but in like 2014 or something, but it really only started to blow up and pull in subscribers 
whenever it started doing this short form content model. And then obviously you've got people like KSI who have created these channels and they're doing clips. They're doing all these short form content, stuff from their YouTube streams and make clips from, you know, taken out of a video and uploaded. And it just gives them a place to go ahead and drive more traffic to their main channel because these short videos blow up really, really easily. They're easily consumed and then they drive engagement. So you can definitely use this sort of model right here where you're doing like fitness content or you could do uh, you know, content on whatever it is that you like or you're interested in, or maybe you have a blog. I've actually been thinking about doing this for one of the blogs I run and uh, driving traffic to my blog through this. I think it's something that if I owned one of these kind of pages right here, if I owned this fitness shorts page, I would definitely have a blog in the description. I would create a blog, I would create some content in there. I would have more optimized affiliate links on the website and I would create a website and brand around this uh, that you could go ahead and then monetize. Obviously, it's gonna give you a head start by able to drive traffic from YouTube. I'd be creating the, the Instagram pages and kind of building that brand out around this. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. I know it was a short one. I know it was kind of just all over the place. But I thought it was a cool model and I know that you know maybe some of you guys haven't seen this or hadn't thought of this and it could help you out with your business maybe your your e-commerce business or if you're trying to start a blog this could be a way to fast track that a little bit I thought it was cool uh hopefully you did too if you did please give it a big thumbs up go ahead hit that subscribe button if you're new here and I'll see you guys in the next video feel free to check out some of the other content here on the channel uh, where I start some blogs or some Etsy content check that out and I'll see you guys soon